Now is the time to make real the promises of democracy. Now is the time. Dr. King was on this earth just 39 years. But the ideas that guided his work and his life are eternal. Through words, he gave voice to the voiceless. My father just wanted to be a great pastor. Well, little did he know that he ended up being a great pastor to the nation and to the world. Today, Dr. King's words ring more hauntingly true than ever. We must learn, he said, to live together as brothers or we all will perish as fools. I think Dr. King was way ahead of his times uh, for a man to speak as young as he was, to speak and talk about uh, hope and faith that this could be a better country. Then he really had to feel this in his heart. We still have a choice today, nonviolent coexistence, a violent co-annihilation. The monument will be but a physical manifestation of the monument already constructed in the lives and hearts of millions of Americans who are more just, more decent, more successful, more perfect because he lived. The King Memorial will span a piece of ground between the Jefferson and Lincoln Memorials. And by its presence in this place, it will unite the men who declared the promise of America and defended the promise of America with the man who redeemed the promise of America. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise. Children today, they know that I have a dream speech. They understand they get a day off from school. They understand that this was somebody in history. But then when they come to the mall, they come and see this memorial, visitors now say, wow, this man was one of the heroes of this country. It takes you back and causes you to ponder and think about what this country would have been like without Dr. King. I'm proud that General Motors helped jumpstart this fundraising back in 2000 by contributing $10 million and will continue to be a driving force in honoring Dr. King's extraordinary and historic contributions. But I'm very pleased how many companies have joined our fundraising effort along the way. He inspired a nation to transform itself begin to live up to the meaning of its creed. And remember, if he were here, he would remind us that the time remains right to do right. We have an opportunity now to invest in carrying this dream to the future. And it'll mean that we personally, our corporations and foundations, must contribute to make sure that this dream lives on and that it is understood by generations yet unborn. We need your help. The future needs your investment. I may not get there with you, but I want you to know the night that we as a people will get to the promised land. Yeah.